Continuing our top story for this evening, we sent you a push alert after police identified the 26-year-old victim who was found dead inside his pickup. We sat down with the victim's girlfriend about all he's leaving behind. KTAB's Danica Hill has the story. What did he do to deserve this? Why did they do this? 26-year-old Stephen Ferris was found dead inside a pickup truck after a crash was called in at mile marker 280 just after 11 p.m. September 21st. He showed me what life was about. He showed me what love was about. And people may have not saw that about that man, but he loved and he loved hard. Cheyenne Worth Ferris's girlfriend says he leaves behind seven children. He had three little boys that wanted to just be just like him. Do everything he ever did. And three little girls, or four little girls that had him wrapped around his finger. According to investigators, the truck Ferris was driving crossed the median and ended up facing the opposite direction in the westbound lane of I 20, but the cause of his death has not been identified. And I just hope that the negativity stops and people just understand. Allowing Worth and Ferris's family time and space to grieve their loss. His family, his kids. All we need right now is just people to support us and be there for us and understand that we're going through a very hard time trying to deal with this. It wasn't something we needed to hear at 11 to 4 o'clock in the morning. In Abilene, with coverage you can count on, Danica Hill, Kate Tab News. Thank you, Danica. Abilene police say this is an ongoing investigation. No arrests have been made.